China's 2013 National Tug of War Championships went down this past weekend in Hohat, the capital city of Inner Mongolia, with nearly a dozen teams competing for tugging supremacy. They represented provinces like Guangdong and Zhejiang, and also major corporations like China Sinopec and Shandong Iron. An official tug of war team is comprised of eight players, and this year's national championships were divided into two main divisions the outdoor grassland event, like the tug of war we know and love, and an indoor pro track event that looked a lot more serious. In each division, several groups competed, including men's, women's, and mixed team events. The event was put on by the General Administration of Sports, so you know it had some serious official status. Even though tug of war is seen mainly as a recreational activity, in fact, in China it falls under the category of social sports. But it has grown considerably in China over the last several years and has already developed its own set of standardized rules and regulations. And China's women's teams happen to be among the best in the world. One of the vice directors of China's social sports business center, Su Baosheng, sees tug of war as a teamwork based sport that can play a positive role in the country's national fitness campaign. And although it is only a social sport, it's important enough to warrant its own national championship.